Well, good evening. It is Friday, October 6th. It is 6.30. Me and Tammy are on a little bit different adventure tonight. It was it was Tammy's night to pick. So I am just going to let her explain to you where we are going and what we're doing. Tammy, you're on. <laughs> We are going to the Downtown Logan Gallery Walk, and I used to go quite often before the pandemic, and then it seemed like it, they quit having it for a while. But um, different businesses in Downtown Logan open up their place and, and um, display local artists' work, and it's, it's kind of fun. It says that there will be food, music, art, and festivities. So we're going to go check it out and see just how fun it is. All right. So, hey, if I've got to go to it, so do you. So here we go. Tammy, Tammy, wait for me. Don't start without me. I won't start without you. All right. First stop, S.E. Needham Jewelers. <laughs> Oh yeah, we come in here to look at art stuff and here's Tammy, she's shopping for rings. I know what her method to her madness is. <laughs> And the next stop, the sportsman. And now we're just getting ready to, well, get through this mess. And I even made it across. And I even had 10 seconds to spare. And now we'll walk into Global Village Gifts. And this one is from Afton, Wyoming. And a Smithfield Barn, if anybody recognizes that. And the main theater in Smithfield. Yeah, it is. I remember right. going to that. I know. And now we are at St. John's Episcopal Church. This is where Kate has done a few piano recitals in here. Art Against the Walls, the Berlin Wall Project. And this is the Candy Bomber. Uh, if you're not familiar with it, you can pause and read this, but they did a special on him, I don't know, a couple years ago on that. It's kind of a neat story and history behind it. And I'm sure this is not part of the walk, but it's worth a little footage. And now we are at the Ibis. We'll walk in here. <laughs> And now we are Soul Speak Yoga. I'm not really sure I'm convinced of all this. We won't tell Tammy. Well, I'm not sure if you can read that, but Logan Fine Art Framing and Art Supplies. We will walk in here now. Well, we came and we conquered. I've got my culture in for me for a while. Tammy, what do you think? 
I had fun. <laughs> it, it is kind of fun walking around down here and that. So anyway, we're going to knock this out and uh, maybe we'll see you tomorrow. Well, not sure how good that'll show up on camera, but just some low fog headed out here. Well, good morning. It is Saturday. It is almost nine o'clock this morning. Me and Tammy just got on the road here. We are actually going over the short divide right now. And as you can see, it's still pretty up this way. And kind of our destination is Lake Cleveland. We'll see if we, uh, We'll see if we make it that far. I'm thinking we probably will. And that's a nice and beautiful day to be out and about. So we're still about two hours away from that. But hey, that's what we do. So anyway, coming right along with us for a minute. Looks like it could be a pretty ride. Hey, it's time for breakfast. Tammy, what you got for us this morning? We eat the same thing. Same thing every morning. We have we split a banana and we have some pecans. All right. Let's Healthy see. first. We made it to Lake Cleveland, and I'll tell you what, it is so pretty here. I just love it. it smells so good. So I'm going to take this little trail right here. And get down a bit closer to the water. And as you can see, I wore some better shoes today, which is a good thing because this is kind of rocky. And hopefully, you don't see me fall on camera. That would be terrible. I was standing up there looking, you can see fish jumping in the water. I could actually see them swimming. Not sure if that will show up. But I can see them swimming. Just all over the place. Wow, that's so cool. spend some time here and just enjoy ourselves. No fishing for us though. That creates work. Well, we just got here to Lake Cleveland. There's Tammy. She's already been down by the water. We're at about, well, we're just a little over 8,000 feet here. Uh, the lake is, it's lower than I thought it would be. Said the same thing. Tammy, did you see any fish? I saw fish. <laughs> I'm always looking for fish swimming in the water. And they've even had a little skiff of snow up there. Bart says not to let Bigfoot get me. <laughs> he dropped me off here on the other end of the lake and I'm gonna walk around. It's kind of a nice little trail and I like getting some exercise. So this is what we're gonna do. Well, I thought about leaving my jacket in the truck because it was hot but now I'm in the shade so I'm glad I have it it's cool in the shade as you can see there are 
Some guys out there in boats fishing. That looks nice and relaxing. Well, I'm glad I wasn't walking along here when this tree fell. That would have been <coughs> a bit scary. I collect rocks with stripes on it, so <laughs> this rock is probably the biggest stripey rock. The one with the most stripes on it I've ever seen. Very cool. Wish I could take it home. And here's a nice reflection scene in the water. Those are always fun. And I can see Bart over there. He's flying the drone. Well, he's flying it my way. I don't know if you can see him. He's quite a ways away. This stairway always fascinates me. Somebody went to a lot of work to build this stairway out of rock. And I always climb up here, and really there's nothing at the top, but I, <laughs> I climb up in any way just for the fun of it. It's not part of the trail. But that's pretty up here. I like how these dead trees look. Mm -hmm. We made it back to Bart. I actually think that staircase that I walked up, I didn't go all the way. Um, I think it goes up to a campground. I think it serves its purpose. Well, we just got here to this Mount McKinney Fire Lookout Tower. And we are at 9,200 feet here. And there's a little snow right there. Tammy, you going down and build a snowman? Did you? All right. Man, there's still some yellow over there on that hillside. What do you think, Tammy? Having fun? Feels like we're at the top of the world. <laughs> we kind of are. And we just stopped here. We're going to sit here and this little look out and eat our lunch. Tammy, what'd you bring us today? This wasn't a really very well planned trip. <laughs> but anyway, I always have these tuna creations. They're kind of nice. And I drink pineapple juice, but of course, our has that drink. Some string cheese. Which, I haven't tried these, I don't think. 
I think they're new. Anyway. For us. We just, just grabbed whatever was laying around. What's in the package? Oh, this? Yeah. I bought this. I don't know. Salami. Hot salami. Of course. Hmm. All right. We'll sit here for a minute. Eat this. Well, we've got something burning here. Not exactly sure what it is. It's pretty black, though. I think it's just... Oh, it is a oh, vehicle. Oh, it's a car. Wow, that oh, was a car. Oh, my gosh. I wonder if it was so black. Wow. Well, 200... 50 miles later, we are right back where we started. We're just uh, coming back through the short divide now. And that, that was a fun little ride out to Lake Cleveland. That's a pretty place out there. We, we enjoy it out there. And that, so I'm going to wrap this video up here. And that, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. And hope to catch on the next one. Have a good one.